Hey guys, so welcome to another week. Got the kitchen window behind me instead of the wreath. <laughs> you might still be able to hear the coffee pot though. Um, just the start of another week. I'm hoping it's a good one. I'm hoping it's a little less stressful than last week. Here's the coffee pot. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I'm just hoping for a better week. Weather, weather wise, it's still cold. So, but it is still March. It's just those days where you get teased with the really nice weather make it so hard to get through the rest of the winter. So, yeah, I'm having a hard time with it. <laughs> I am not a fan of winter at all. So he's a little worse for wear, but he's still putting on a brave face. Ha ha ha. <laughs> That's about as brown as I like a banana. And just waiting for this stuff to get done enough to make my coffee. Well, it's Tuesday <clears throat> and you know, yesterday I said it was going to be cold all week. It's going to be cold almost all week. It's Yesterday it was like 50. Today it's supposed to get up to 77. But the bad thing about that is that's supposed to cause some thunderstorms later. Which I don't mind thunderstorms. I actually like thunderstorms. It's, they're saying possibly severe. I feel like I have a hair. But anyway... I don't like severe thunderstorms with like hail, high winds, that kind of stuff. I love just a good old fashioned thunderstorm with the thunder and the lightning and rain. I love those. But yeah, 77 today. Then the whole rest of the week, 30s for the lows, 50s for the highs. It's supposed to rain all day tomorrow, but we'll see. This, I don't know. I'm not going to give you a weather forecast every single day this week. I feel like I'm like... Welcome to Angie's Weather Channel. But, um, yeah, yesterday went all right, work-wise. Um, I did, a co-worker and I spent like an hour on the phone together just commiserating with one another, and that helped a lot. So, but, um, yeah, now I'm just waiting for the coffee pot to get enough coffee in it for me to be able to make my coffee and then I'm gonna get headed out the door so hoping hoping for a good day oh and then after work we went to the gym came home watched TV <laughs> oh and I played some Kirby and some Animal Crossing just a little bit but you know nothing nothing exciting <laughs> Hello there, it's Wednesday, so my timing is impeccable, <laughs> the coffee pot. <sighs> so I know I said I wasn't going to give a weather report every day and I'm not, but we did get thunderstorms last night, but at least in where I live in my area, they were just normal, you know, thunder, lightning, rain. But all around, there was like tornado warnings and stuff. I don't know that there was ever actually a tornado. Um, I didn't see anything saying that. But um, <clears throat> I'll look at the news like after I get to work and see. Um, but at least what I could see this morning, I didn't see any reports of it. So hopefully not. Um, but yeah, I ate my last banana yesterday. So... I don't, I just, so today I just have my clementines. I don't have a banana, so no smiley face greeted me this morning. <laughs> um, but I'm trying to think. Yeah, just a normal, just a normal week. <laughs> so I'm going to make some roasted radishes in the air fryer. So cut them in half and put them in a bowl and then coat them with olive oil and salt and pepper and I think I might use some garlic too 
and then you put them in the air fryer at 400 for 15 to 17 minutes. Our air fryer will do them in 15 and um, they're really good. I don't even know how to explain them, but they're really good. That's what I'm doing for part of my dinner tonight. The other part's going to be a salad. Got them all sliced. That noise you hear is the air fryer preheating. Salt, pepper, and olive oil. And I'm going to add a little chopped garlic. And now I'm going to put them in the air fryer. And I'm going to cook them for 15 minutes. Last time I did it, that made them really pretty crispy. And I'm going to shake them like about halfway through too. And there they are all roasted. The good news, radishes are very low calorie. And if you do like a low carb diet, which I don't, but if you do, they're a good option for low carb diets too. So, but these are gonna be so good. And then for the rest of my dinner, I'm gonna have this salad and play some Kirby. It's Thursday, so it's the last day of the week. I'll be driving down to the building, so that's always nice. Um, I have like mixed, I like being able on Fridays to sleep in a little bit, but I like being down at the building because I have my dual monitors and stuff and like a headset and all that kind of stuff. But normally Fridays are low meeting days and you know, it's just, I don't know. I have mixed feelings about it, but I'm very, very grateful that I get to work from home on a Friday. So mostly because of the sleeping in part. <laughs> but anyway, I took a little bit of time this morning and I curled my hair. Um, so I like doing that sometimes, especially like if I straightened it earlier in the week or, you know, I just, I've tried to do something different than always just pulling it back, but so yeah, I need to quit rambling and get on the road because it took extra time this morning to do a little curling. <laughs> So today is Friday. I'm so glad. And my oldest has had, we think it's like a cold. It's definitely not COVID because since we have at home COVID tests now, we went ahead and did a COVID test and it was, I mean, you could tell it was negative almost right off the bat. It never, the line that's supposed to be there for like COVID never even got anything on it. So it's just, you know, regular cold. The job they do, they work with the public, so, you know, you get colds and stuff. It's just, you know, nowadays, it's like, you just, every time you feel sick, you're like, oh my god, is it COVID? So, even though all of us are vaccinated and everything, but anyway, the point of me even telling you that is, I woke up this morning with a sore throat, and that's like one of their main complaints is their throat hurts. And then, They've got like a runny nose and a little cough and stuff. So it's like, oh no, am I going to get a spring cold? And I'm feeling like I am. Hopefully, I just drank some emergency, um, which is a lot of vitamin C. And vitamin C is supposed to help colds not last as long. And we have found that that works for us, that our colds don't normally last as long if we drink that stuff. So anyway certainly can't hurt. I mean, having some extra vitamin C, which, you know, I eat like two clementines a day or mandarin oranges or you'd think I would have plenty of vitamin C. But anyway, that's, um, 
yeah, my throat hurts this morning. When I first woke up, it was scratchy, and I've had one cup of coffee, and I'm on my second cup now, and it's not, you know, I was thinking the warmth might help, but it still feels the same, so. I hate colds. But anyway, I just wanted to get on and say it's Friday. I'm getting ready to go to a meeting here in 10 minutes and just get this day done. The week's not been as bad as last week, like stress-wise, but uh, it's just how it is. I still have 15 years before I can retire, so anyway, it's Friday. Yay! Second cup of throat coat. This tea normally works really pretty well for me when I have a sore throat. And I've had one cup already and my throat is, it's like as the day has gone on has gotten progressively more sore. By the way, dropping my Belinda packet into my cup happens to me more than it should. <laughs> At least when I do drop it, I've already poured all the Splenda out, so that's good. morning guys it is Saturday it's about 6 30 in the morning and I've been sitting here um, watching a little news and just got a cup of coffee and I'm gonna find a movie to watch and just chill out um, I definitely have a cold got a full box of Kleenex here I got my coffee I'm gonna get a movie and just chill out on this Saturday. <laughs> this is my movie buddy here. Hey, movie buddy. <laughs> I'm gonna watch this movie called Triangle. I keep hearing that it's good, so I think it's supposed to be like a scary movie, but anyway, that's what I'm gonna watch this morning. The triangle was really good. It was, I haven't ever seen a movie like that before. It was really good. I liked it. And uh, so now I'm going to watch a movie called The Monsters. It, um, I'm not expecting it to be good. I'm expecting it to be like campy or, I don't know, not campy. I don't know how to explain it, but it's like a creature feature. I think it's, it's on HBO and forget now what I was where I was going it's supposed to be about aliens but it's called monsters so I don't know but I'm gonna watch a couple of movies watch triangle now I'm gonna watch this one and then Brian's working on taxes and then I think I might play some Kirby and I'm just taking it easy today you know I'm not going anywhere I am probably just gonna stay in my pajamas all day and uh, Get better. <laughs> the movie Monsters was really boring, in my opinion. Hey guys, so now it's 8.25 p.m. and I'm coming back in the bedroom. I actually 
after I watched that second movie, I went and I played Kirby for a long time. And then we had dinner. And uh, now I'm coming back in the bedroom. Brian went and he got me some of the Kleenex with the lotion in them. Because I'm like blowing my nose so much. <laughs> I hate colds. They're just very uncomfortable. You know that like feeling you get like you feel like you have to sneeze constantly and stuff so I've come in the bedroom I'm gonna find like a ghosty show or something and uh, I just have taken it easy all day and my throat hurts less today than it did yesterday but you know all the head stuff is going on today so I'm hoping tomorrow <laughs> will be better um, so I'm just miserable and I hope Brian doesn't get this but I'm just gonna hang out at home tomorrow too I mean I don't want to go out I don't feel good for one and also I don't want to put all my germs out there so uh, yeah it's been it's actually I mean other than feeling really bad it's been a pretty good day I mean um, I got my laundry done Friday only had one load and then Kirby I actually defeated the main game I've been playing it a little bit in the evenings and then today I played for several hours but um, yeah I defeated the main game but there's like an extra bonus level like levels afterwards and then there's a bunch of like little mini games and then I'm gonna go back through some of the levels that I completed because I didn't get like every single little secret thing and stuff. That game's really fun. I like it a lot. So Kirby in the Forgotten Land. But so yeah, now I'm just gonna find something else on TV. And he's back. Django. Django. <laughs> he's so handsome. guys it's Sunday morning and now I have a cough so <laughs> this cold is just progressing day by day hopefully it will go away soon but anyway I'm not going to do anything today so I'm going to go ahead and wrap the vlog up for the week and uh, it's just a cold you know colds they go away you get better you're just miserable for a little bit so um anyway i feel like i'm gonna have to start coughing so anyway thank you for spending the week with me